Hi guys, Dr. Ben here. Um, quick tip, inspired by a conversation I had with a patient earlier uh, today. Um, I'm seeing more and more patients who are complaining um, of signs of estrogen dominance. And there's so many things in our lifestyle that we can do to control these symptoms. Um, I'll flash up um, a list of symptoms in men and symptoms in women that uh, sort of indicate that there might be increased levels of circulating estrogen. I'll do it right here. One of the most important things that we can do in our lifestyle, and this was highlighted in a study that I came across last month, and that was that one drink of alcohol um, increases circulating estrogen levels by 26%. That's just one drink per day. If you can imagine, you know, many people are doing two or three glasses of wine with supper. Um, that would go up 30, 40, 50% increase in, in circulating estrogen. So if you have any of these symptoms um, in women, breast tenderness, irregular bleeding, um, difficulty losing abdominal weight, um, lots of bloating, uh, fatigue, low libido, um, a propensity towards low moods or depression, um, it's really important that you, you take this simple step first. It can be as easy as taking out alcohol. It can make a huge difference on your cycle and your, your hormone balance. Um, in men, um, same thing. Abdominal weight, um, erectile dysfunction, uh, low energy, um, enlarged prostate. Um, these are, again, all signs that estrogen levels are spiking. So if you have any of these symptoms, um, do your body um, some good and, and just remove alcohol over a couple months to see what, what changes. Thanks for listening.